Okay, we've just arrived in uh, Bora Bora. We just got off the boat. Um, and we are at the Yacht Club Bora Bora. And I would say it's very, very, very cool. I'm, I'm actually impressed. <laughs> yeah. So welcome to, welcome to the Bora Bora Yacht Club. <laughs> we are members in good standing. <laughs> Which means we have a key to the door. <laughs> Maybe not. But this is what the yacht club looks like without anybody here. Mm -hmm. it's, it's Sunday. Sunday. It's closed. And it might open, I'm not sure, but it's very, very cool. Oh, bocce. Bocce ball. And the showers. We can actually take showers. Showers and oh, toilets no. are right here. And we'll probably look. take advantage of those. And also we got some pretty cool underwater tables. And the anchorage is out here. There's Muskoka. And that's a dinghy dock over yonder. And the big resorts are on the motus outside there. Right, and we come to the main dock in Bora Bora. So the the famous mountain right there. Oh, we can almost see the top. Almost see the top. And we're in town. Mm -hmm. Looks exactly. pretty cool. And tourists. We're tourists now. We've turned to tourists. Anyway, so that's a, a one of the high-speed ferries. I think it goes to the airport. airport. What do you think? I think it might go to the resorts too. Yeah, it might. <laughs> so we're out for a little dinghy ride, and we just come around the corner from where our marina is, and that is kind of the the shot that everybody thinks about Bora Bora. That's the Bora Mountain or whatever they call it. It's got a name, but we don't know what it is. I'll post it below. Yes. We're gonna go to Bora. We're kind of on the out, outer fringes of the reef right now. A long way from anywhere, really. And uh, you know, we came out here to look for some wildlife. Oh, oh there's something now, yeah. yeah. What do we got here? Oh yeah, dogs, puppy dogs. They've got even have collars. Yeah, you, look at that. What do you guys do? Guess what we're doing? We're on a scooter ride. And we're in front of the very famous Bloody Mary's restaurant. And you can pull your boat up to the dock. But this isn't about boating, this is about scooters. Land travel. Land travel. Mm -hmm. Well, here we go. This doesn't have disaster written all over it. One hand camera. Rental scooter. So we're still out on our scooter ride, and I came around this corner and I saw a, a Lagoon 400. It was awesome. I thought, well, who's here? There's Muskoka. Hopefully she's still making water. So we're at Hiva in Bora Bora. So this is the uh, place of the uh, action last night. A little bit quieter this morning. Mm -hmm. You can see the grandstands there. And there's Joy. <laughs> Ta-da! So he, ta -da. <laughs> And if you get Hank, you get Lisa. <laughs> That's the main town. And our boat is anchored 
over there. <laughs> morning. Good morning. So it's uh, Muskoka um, checking out of French Polynesia in Bora Bora. So there's the mountain of Bora Bora. And this is us. And we're sadly checking out of French Polynesia on our way to the gendarme, mm -hmm. which is in town. And they only have hours 90 days, so we're out of here, unfortunately. just started we just started the, the hike up and uh, it's pretty steep we're already getting some views very nice <laughs> it's pretty nice it is beautiful beautiful enough for a rope. That's where we're headed. And that's mid-station view. Uh, what do you think, Laura? Beautiful view. Absolutely gorgeous. Pretty good up here. We made it, folks. <laughs> the peaks we can see from below. Me them. too. <laughs> Just for proof. <laughs> And our boat is right down there. That's where we were up there. So we're on a bike ride in Moputi and uh, Anila. Oh, you're up ahead. So this is the back side of Moputi. What do you think? Pretty sandy. Pretty idyllic. This would be a great trade surfing launch period area with it. Kite servers take note. You probably already know it's here. So there's one hill here, this is it, and then there's a switchback, here comes a car, and this is the switchback, it's pretty nice. So I think we found our favorite island. Yeah, it definitely is. swim with the giant manta rays. This island is full of them, which is fantastic. So footage for tomorrow. Out in Mapiha, and we're on the Motu, I guess. Between two Motus. So we left our craft there. We walked into that woods over there, and there was nesting boobies. And what'd you see? We saw a baby booby with nice fluffy white. Yes. The mother was feeding. So one of my favorite sayings is, you gotta get off the boat. And this is why you gotta get off the boat. You wouldn't have seen that. We were looking for treasure and in my eyes, that was treasure.
Okay, this is Mopelia, and uh, um, this is Harry. We had dinner with Harry last uh. night. Stand over here, Harry. Bonjour. And uh, Harry invited me back to uh, do some copra with him. And we, we, when you sail these islands, you know that these guys produce copra, which is coconut. And now I'm going to find out how to do it. So that's what we're doing here, right? We, uh. we, oui? we oui. oui. produce copra. 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 Okay. So this is Harry. I'm Scott, and we're going to go work. Uh, all right. Oh, the costique oui. de copra. Okay. Let's do it. Good. <laughs> <laughs> C'est tout fini. Voilà, fini. Oui. So the last part of uh, copra is taking the meat someplace. I'm really not sure. The hard work's done. So you have to get a load of this. So we've got the copra shed, the drying shed, and we've got the pigs. Hello, piggies. Hello. So that's our copra. That's what we shucked today. Ferme la porte. Okay, now I get to close the roof. Bye bye, piggies. Very slick. Well engineered. Fantastic. It's cooking. So that concludes my copra. Oops, almost forgot. Bubba. So that concludes my uh, copra thing. Glad I did it. It was fantastic. Now I gotta get the boat ready. We're going to Suaro. It's a uh, five day passage or 40 passage or something like that. And we're out here in about four hours. Oh.